Rafael Alcorta is one of the defenders with the most appearances in the history of La Liga. With 370 games and two league titles to his name, the talented centre-back achieved big things in his career at Athletic Club and Real Madrid. He still follows La Liga from his home in Bilbao and sees Real Madrid as the favourites to win the competition this year. There have been many games in which their play hasn't been that good this year, but they've won. They're a team of winners. They've got a good mentality. And I believe Zidane has managed to put together a very deep squad, with players ready at any moment. I think he's a football man, a man who's made the most of everyone's respect for what he was as a player. He's taken full advantage of that push. I think he's also very natural. He's a guy who says things in a natural way. I think he's handling the dressing room really well. And that's the key to success. There's not much more to it. It's hard work, and he also likes to have a fit team. I think Madrid will be difficult to knock off the top. Barca have to step up a bit. In the end, it'll again be between the two of them. I thought Atletico were going to fight a little more this year. Alcorta also has praise for Athletic Club and Ernesto Valverde. What Athletic are doing once again is spectacular. Their play has its ups and downs, but they're competing in the trailing pack with very good teams. They've got injuries and players who have to be used sparingly. But Ernesto, as always, stays calm. The club keep bringing through new players, giving them minutes. The kids respond, and that's what's bringing athletic success right now. I think an important part is Benyat. He had a long battle with injuries. When Banyat's playing well, the team have a little more to their game. Then you've got two players up front who were among the best in La Liga, Raul and Aritz. Many times you play with them directly using the second ball. It's not always necessary, but it's quite effective because they bring many balls down. It's a way of attacking. When Benyat's fit again and starts taking command of the team, we'll see more of the Athletic of last year, with a little more play and especially more attack from outside the box. For Alcorta, the key to the success and future of Athletic Club depends on Lezama. It has to work. It's worked forever and will continue doing so. Every year kids are coming through from there. They're responding to the opportunity. There are people who have been with Kuko Ziganda for years. I think he's a very important part of athletic success in recent years of getting players into La Liga. Among the new generation, Gepa stands out especially. He's the modern goalkeeper. He's good with his feet. He's a serious no-frills player who does his job. He's very young. He will make mistakes, just as we all do. But it's clear he also has a good teacher in Gorka. That suits him because Gorka has lots of experience. I think we're going to have a good goalkeeper for many years to come. And that's not forgetting Yeray Alvarez, who returned a few weeks ago after overcoming his fight with cancer. He's got a good head on his shoulders, and that's important. Especially when you play in that position, you know you're going to make a few mistakes. But he doesn't make many. He does what he has to do. Over time, he will improve in many ways. But at the moment, I think he's grabbed the bull by the horns and said, here I am, and I'm here to stay. After his experience as coach of Olympiacos and Olympic Marseille, Rafael Corta is not ruling out a position in the dugout in the not-too-distant future. I've got something here, I've got the bug. The thing is, now I'm in a moment of my life, when I want to be in Bilbao, I want to enjoy time with my children. I'm doing other things, but you always have to be prepared, just in case. Rafael Corta is a living legend of La Liga who hopes to someday return to football.